Suppose that price is $16, per capita income is $40, population is 470, and the percent elderly is 25%. What is the log of the quantity demanded? Well, all of this output in the regression is given as the natural log form. So our estimate quantity is going to look like this. The ln of quantity is equal to our intercept, 5, minus 2.25, which is our price coefficient. Now this is where you have to pay attention. It's times not just the price variable of 16, but it's times the ln of that price variable of 16. And this is true for all of our variables. So instead of 40, we're putting in the ln of 40 for per capita income. Instead of 470, we're putting in the ln of 470 for population, and so on and so forth. All those are just numbers, of course, and we can solve that the ln of q is equal to 8.096. The next question to ask is what is the upper control limit for a 95% confidence interval for the log of quantity demanded? Well, we just solved for the log of quantity demanded. We know that an upper control limit is equal to that number plus 2 times the root mean squared error. So we can plug in our components. 8.096 is the log of quantity demanded. 2 times our root mean squared error is 0.07, and we see that our upper control limit is equal to 8.236.